posted by you slash thustadires 30 wife cheated on me with multiple AP and my kids are not mine. Wasted 30 plus years. 21 June 2021 Okay this started when my wife died 3 years ago. We married in 1986. Waiting for a postmortem that took 2 weeks. Needed the paperwork so we could put her to rest, the sons and I decide to start recycle her things she left behind, charging up old phones laptops to see if they still worked and going through her papers, we found a cache of love letters and texts she had kept hidden from me long story short. She had been having an affair that started in the first year of the marriage, about six months in, until he died seven years ago. Cancer so his last text says a month before he died I check him out and he did die of cancer. I didn't know a thing about it as I worked nights. Backstory We met at a holiday camp in Scotland in 1979. We dated till we married in 1986. She came from a small village. We married and live in this village until her death. Finding the hidden love letters from the AP, I find out he thought that one of the kids we had was his. We have four boys. I also found out I was the laughing stock with the whole village that they all knew. I've lived in this village for 30 plus years and I'm still the outsider. Blind as a bat, I worked permanent nights four days a week I didn't see any red flags even now looking back I still don't. Seems she could gaslight for Scotland in the Olympics, he was a friend of the family from talking to our kids they knew nothing they say he was never around late at night if he came to the house he always left by 2100 hours or 9 pm. I left for work around 2130 or 930 pm if you don't do 24 hr clock. From the letters and texts it was well known in the village, and that I'm the laughing stock. The boys too want a DNA test and two don't. Two think it might be them the other two say I'm their dad. Revenge, I owned the plot next to where her mom and dad are buried. She wanted to be next to the mom and dad one side her AP on the other. Found that out from the texts on her phone and the graveyard registry. So when the body and paperwork was released I had her body moved 300 miles away down to England and buried in a grave down there. One regret I didn't have time to cremate her first. The village is pissed at me as I moved out back to England, nowhere near her grave a place that I don't go to. I told them they made me. The outsider for 30 plus years I lived in the village and they never forgive me for being born in England. That they all knew what she was doing and never told me. That they can't complain about me not putting her to rest next to her AP or her mom and dad and here's the kicker if they want to move her grave. They will need a judge to allow them to dig her up and move her and that I own the plot and will never allow her in there. DNA tests, all the kids had a meeting and want a DNA tests done on all of us they got 5 tests we did them and posted them edit, I forgot to tell you I have took a STD test and failed. Seems she gave me the clap. Doctors say it can be controlled but can't be gotten rid of it will always be in my blood. They don't know how much damage has already been done or for how long I have had it. But being as the youngest is 20 and is clear I would say less than 20 years. Before reading updates let's see top comments Dastin 72 man you should move out of that village they didn't accept you from the beginning. I think it's better to be leaving that place. Sell the plots or houses if you have in there. These people didn't realize what they have done laughing at a wounded man should be ashamed of themselves to be called as a man these cnts didn't have balls just know how to pour salt on the wound if these cnts didn't bother him before for telling what is happening behind his back then they don't have rights to tell him or get angry where he want his wife's grave op replies i moved out as soon as i could the kids still go back now and then as their mothers Sister still lives there they are close to her Sikrim comments that's why I don't recommend someone moving to their spouse's hometown. You'll always be the outsider no matter what and they'll usually side with your spouse regardless of what they do. OP replies they won't know what hit them I've not finished with that village yet the walk of shame will hit it at full strength. RFNZ comments I feel, sorry for the kids really. Imagine finding out your dad isn't really your father after your mum dies and then find out your father has been dead for a few years. Going from happy family to orphan essentially, but with this dude who raised you as his own, feeling like a chump. Op, I hope you continue to love all four of your boys. There is nowhere for them to go, they've grown, and they'll have families of their own soon. This is probably the only situation I can think of where I would say to not get those tests done mate. OP replies the tests are done we had two results back out of the five not looking good. The kids got and paid for the tests point four kids, one for me. Mine not back yet. This tar in comments leave that sad little village behind. 
If she has any remaining family there it wouldn't. Surprise me if one of them sues you to get the body back. And if they can't get a remedy in the civil courts they might just take the law into their own hands. Be prepared, this is going to get ugly. OP replies she has been planted they will need a court order to dig her up and they won't get one, and to dig her up without one is a long long stay in the big house also own the grave that want to. Put her in next to her mom and dad and her AP on the other side. The other side of her mom's grave is full. They can try to put her in the graveyard but not between her mom slash dad and her AP plus they need a court order to reintern her. I've told the kids they can have it so they can be laid to rest there next to their grandmother and grandfather. The grave is for six bodies, and kick AP ghost only. Thing they can't do is move their mother in one. They wouldn't get a judge to dig her up in the first place as an English judge wouldn't allow her to be dug up in the first place. Two they will never get a Scottish judge to allow her remains to be brought from England to Scotland. Three I own the grave and will not allow her to be put in it. That's in my will. Update, one long story short my wife of 35 years died three years ago, sorting out her things to be recycled. I found out she had a AP from the first year we were married to seven years ago when he died. We have four sons and through the letters and later from texts, he believes that one of them is his son. So three weeks ago the kids asked me to take a DNA tests, as two say they're mine and two not sure, so five tests were sent to be tested. No I didn't know she was having an affair as I worked nights for the whole marriage. She could gaslight with style, I suspected nothing. We have four sons all over 20. They all say they hope I'm their bio dad as that know the scumbag the letters and texts are from. Okay the cat's out of the bag. One of my sons got drunk and told everyone what I found out. Now everyone in the village is asking me why I never suspect her. I told them I worked nights and no one in the village told me, all this time a laughing stock, but I will soon find out what sons are actually mine. Let's see some comments before reading next update. His views askew says they're all your sons. It takes far more than an emission to be a father. Stephen Thesailer replies this is the standard response to this situation, but the reality is that if true it will rock the foundation of their relationships, with unknown consequences. For sure their relationships will not be the same. Update, two cats out of the bag not going over grounds of posted I've posted before look on my posts it's in there. Two of the five DNA tests are back my two sons phoned me to tell me that they got their DNA test results back. Eldest and second eldest, it seems that they're only one half. Brothers, I will have to wait till mine comes back. All four sons will be home this weekend so I can see their online DNA page results. If the other two get theirs back, we will have to work out what's happening. If they have any other one half siblings slash full siblings, if so who they are and what their dad's name, of his other one half sibling, need my results as well so I can see who's mine. You're not woke. Comments he might be the sperm donor to one of your kids, but you are their father. Please don't let their DNA determine your role in their lives. I am so sorry your wife did this to you. It is so unfair, and must be so hard to not be able to confront her and get your questions answers. No one should be treated that way. I hope you find happiness and peace. Buwansis replies this is so so wrong. Typical female bullshitting. He might raise a kid, but being the father means a kid from his own DNA. How do you define being a mother? How would you feel if another woman gives birth to the child you have to raise with your husband? OP replies the boys are already wondering who it is as the POS had kids with his wife. They talk about who has one half brothers and sisters, he had two of each, they do this when they think I can't hear, hard to whisper when you're drunk. The kids must have heard rumors before I found out. Being as they go there for a few days every few months to see their mom's sister who still lives there. I've not been back since I found out and cut that part and everyone there out of my life completely. The kids must have heard rumors before I found out. Being as they go. There for a few days every few months to see their mom's sister who still lives there. I've not been back since I found out and cut that part and everyone there out of my life completely. The tests are done results should be ready anytime in the next two weeks, four to six weeks, as this is week four. The kids insisted and took their own test and got me one. I think I've lost them anyway all they're talking. About one half brothers or sisters they might have that they never knew about. Update 3 the results are in yes all five results are back from both sites. Ancestry and 23 and me, let me tell you we're sorting through the results we got. Checking them, seems that my family line stops with me. 
The surname will carry on but no part of my blood will. All four boys are half-siblings and all four of them have other half-siblings. That show. Up on their results pages, ancestry, that show if there's others DNA results near to your results and how you're related. One we thought was AP son was not, it was different one. He has two half-brothers and two half-sisters. He is the second in line by three months. So his dad's wife was four or five month pregnant and showing a baby bump when he was conceived. Older brother. One has one half brother and two half sisters who he is the middle child, 23 and me, God help him an older sister. By two years, the last one of the four is the eldest, by a year, to his half sibling a brother, and is a real arse hole he will get his face punched if he starts shit with my son. Short fuse much, so if you've not worked it out none of the boys are mine and, none of my blood in their veins. None of them have the same. Father. We've been sorting through the results we got from two independent DNA sites. First week in September at the, compulsory, community open village meeting, it's the one that vote in new people. Everyone will shows to stop being nominated into office. I will have all my ducks in a row. Countdown has started getting ready to go nuclear on their arses. One I know a few divorces will be started and, some crap people will be ran out of the village. There might be a heart attack or two. Two make 70 copies of texts and love letters. Check. Three DNA tests results and links copied check let's see top comments before last post. 33 say what 33 comments I'm so sorry the village did not defend you when they all knew. That must hurt. I hope you address the village they have blood on their hands. Let me know. How meeting goes. OP replies with a bang it's not happened yet but it will first week in September. And I am ready for it there's a few wives will not know what hit them when I introduce my boys to their half siblings. With proof. Let's see their hubbies talk their way out of that. I raised four boys found out not my sons. Four sons did DNA tests and have four different fathers going to nuclear on village. That is that fact as all four fathers came from there. Last post two days ago I've been asked to update. Stop it already I will update when I have something to post. The die has been cast. I got hold of the chairperson and asked if I can talk at the meeting as a lot of people want to know why my wife was not buried in the local graveyard. Why my house in the village is unoccupied. I asked if I can do the talk before they hold the election so I can get to work on time. I don't even work in Scotland now. I got an email back saying they would welcome me to talk at the meeting as I still own a house in the village and because of my work commitments I will be able to talk first. The bomb has been planted and set. Let's see few comments no blackberry 7887 comments I wish you the best of luck and hope. You make it through stronger than ever. You have been wronged the worst way possible. I hope you will find peace. You deserve so much better. I hope you stick it to them all. OK television 9278 comments be calm and firm. Don't lose your cool or toss insults back at people. Will you have many copies of the DNA test for people who want one? Thanks for watching if you enjoyed this video please leave a like and also subscribe for more videos like this. Hit the notification bell as well.